middle-class community lifestyle when they moved to the suburbs, some middle-class blacks looked for existing African-American enclaves, while others sought predominantly white neighborhoods. By the mid-1970s, dining out, attending sporting events, and traveling abroad increasingly accounted for black recreational choices. This was a shift from previous patterns focused primarily on entertaining at home, church activities and cotillions. Long-established service-oriented clubs like Jack and Jill attracted prosperous black the city had become the crucible of African American life. The Soul City Sounder. Soul City, North Carolina, promoted in 1969 as a planned community and targeting African Americans, Soul City was to encompass 5,000 acres near Henderson, North Carolina. Developer Floyd McKissick secured funding from the Department of Housing and Urban Development. However, lacking sufficient support and investment from potential buyers, development in Soul City ceased after eight years. So the first residential Residential land sales are made at Seoul City, and the Tally family, first family to purchase a lot in Seoul City. And there is a photo of Floyd McKissick right there.